All right, uh, it's pretty late, but uh, I'm kind of excited. Got this thing kind of working here. Bit of a hack, but uh, so, anyways, uh, connected here, and what I've got it uh, to do here is uh, basically I'm going to home it. I'm going to disable the motor so that I can set an arbitrary angle that the uh, IK constraints can solve. Uh, it's one of the main issues that the homing uh, location was actually something that was a bit of a, a mess for the... Uh, so anyways, it thinks that theta is at 90 and PSI is at 0 degrees. And I can ask it here, uh, give it a 1 and 14. And it thinks that we're at X100 and Y185. Uh, if I can ask it to go to Y150, I'll back it up a little bit here and ask it to move, and it should. There we go. So now it's uh, it thinks it's gone back uh, 35 millimeters. I can ask it to go uh, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10. Let's see. Let's go in X. I'll do 10 millimeter increments. Here's one millimeter. Pretty sexy. <laughs> I don't know. And point one is actually moving, believe it or not. There are 400 millimeter, or uh, 400 steps per uh, revolution motors hooked up to some gears and belts. Anyways, thanks for watching, dude.